are so honored that you could be here with us today to help us celebrate the re-grand opening of our brand new Veterans Services Center. We made a decision that um, all of the colleges, each of the 10 colleges would have a Veterans Center. You made the right decision by, by giving them the courage to stand up and say, you know what, Uncle Sam, I'm gonna serve for you. I think that's a strong message to tell these kids and to tell the families. When they go in their service, you can count on people here. Right here at Glendale Community College, your student, your person that's now in the military, if you have problems, you can come here, right here to the Veterans Center, and they can help those families. This building is amazing. It's huge. It's, it's everything that you would want as a veteran going to a school. It's the help you need. It's, I don't know what's going on. I have a question with this. Can you help me? Yes, let's do it. Come in today. Let's get this done. The welcome and the, the partnership that the state of Arizona and that the uh, uh, county of Maricopa gives to active duty reserve guard and our prior service members is, is second to none. But as much as we like the building and as much as it's about the building today and the rededication, in the end, I think all of us know it's really about the people that it's going to serve. And that's these great young men and women that have served our country, uh, that have been out there and have stood up for this thing right here, the stars and stripes and all the values that it holds and all the freedom that it symbolizes across this world. My name is Jonathan Parsons. I'm a U.S. Army veteran. I served from 2003 to 2012. I think it's a great facility. I think it's uh, very important for uh, vets. It gives them a liaison for when they get out. They can kind of transfer into that civilian stage, and it gives them a lot of resources. It's kind of emotional because of all the wonderful things it's going to uh, provide for our veterans. It's our obligation here to make sure that they're not just getting a degree to get a job, but to get a degree to get a, a career and move forward.